Hi, I'm Anthony Bryan, Product Evangelist with Jscape. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Jscape's AnyClient, which is a free platform independent file transfer application that supports all the major file transfer protocols, including FTP, FTPS, SFTP, and WebDAV. It's also available as a web-based service requiring no software installation and as a downloadable application that you can install locally. This is Jscape's AnyClient. I'm using the downloaded and installable version. And if you click Connect and New, you can create a new site in the Site Manager. You have to put information in like the host and username and password. And then as you can see, you can change the connection type to any of the supported protocols. And you can see I have a couple other sites there. To connect, you just highlight the site and click connect. And as you can see, now we're connected. The pane on the left side is the local file system. And the right is the remote file system, the server that you just FTP'd into. The Browse Local button lets you change directories, and the Browse Remote button does the same. So let's select a bunch of files and click the Zip Upload. Here we'll give a name for the remote file. And then click OK. And right now the file is being zipped. And here the file is being uploaded. And it finished. You can also download files by double clicking them or by clicking this button here in the middle. And you can upload files by doing the same thing. So you can make directories, rename files, delete files, refresh, resume, upload, and the previously shown zip upload from the local. And on the remote system, you can make a directory, rename, delete, refresh, resume, and download too. So in this video, we showed you the basics of any client. If you've used other FTP clients before, it should be pretty familiar. For more information on any client, please visit jscape.com.